Hey everybody, so today I'm just going to be talking about classics that I think would be good for a beginner to start off with. Uh, most of these are just modern classics because obviously they are post 1900, they are easier to read but they do still fall into the classics bracket. The first one is To Kill a Mockingbird by Harper Lee. This one I feel is very important for everybody to read no matter what genre that you usually do read. This is very enjoyable, very easy to read, very it is a harder novel to read in terms of the topics that it deals with, but again, it is a very good book to start off with, just because um, it's so entertaining and it's so in it's so different getting to, to follow a child's point of view, and especially with it being so well written. But I would highly recommend this book if you're not used to classics, but you would like to start reading more of them. The next book that I would like to talk about is another one that is quite easy to read, especially for a beginner, and that is Rebecca by Daphne du Maurier. I don't know how to pronounce her name, I think it's that, but if I'm wrong, please let me know. This is such a nice cover, I love my cover of it. I, mean, I actually, my the cover that I actually read this out of originally got ruined, so I got a new copy and it's actually so nice. This book is just basically follows a girl who marries a man and this man is extremely mysterious. He seems like he has a lot to hide. The book is filled with suspense. You never really know what is going to happen and you never really can predict. Well, I didn't predict what the end result was going to be and what ends up happening. It is quite easy to read. So I probably wouldn't start with this one, but if you are starting into classics and you've read a couple before, then I would recommend reading this one because it is extremely entertaining. The next one I am going to recommend is one that a lot of people do know about and a lot of people have read, and that is The Outsiders by Essie Hinton. A lot of people do love this book. It's very short, very easy to read. The writing isn't hard to understand at all. It's a modern classic. It's one of those ones that is just so entertaining the whole way through. You could easily read it in one sitting. Basically, it deals with gang culture. Two boys from this gang that we mainly follow get themselves into trouble and it's about how they deal with that. It's extremely entertaining. As I said, you could read it in one sitting. And Honestly, I would start out, probably start out with this novel if you were starting to read classics. Next book I'm going to talk about is my favourite novel of of all time. It's my favourite one. I always recommend this to anybody. And that is The Catcher in the Rye by J.D. Salinger. I know like a lot of people do like, like this book, but I think a lot of people do hate it. So maybe it's um, like you love it or hate it kind of book. But I absolutely love it. It just basically follows Holden Caulfield as he drops out of school and it's how everything that happens to him within this short period of time. It's very, very entertaining the whole way through it dealing with mental illness but in the, very, in, in the best way that I've ever seen it portrayed. And so if you're interested in that, I would 100% recommend this. And it's very easy to read, very realistic, very good to start out with. The last book I'm going to recommend is actually a children's book. Um, it's a very good one to be your first classic. Because um, it's a story that we all know and love. And that's Peter Pan by J.M. Barry. No matter what age you are, I personally think this book is extremely, extremely, extremely entertaining to read. I absolutely love Peter Pan. I've always loved Peter Pan. I love the Disney Peter Pan. I love like the, the movie that was made. Um, a few years ago, like the one with like real actors and all, um, that one was so great. I loved that, and I also loved the book whenever I read it because I mainly because I love Peter Pan but as well. If you've never, if you don't really like Peter Pan, I would still say it's one of those books that you should read. Just even just to say that you've read it, and it's very very easy to start off with. It's a very easy classic to read. It's it's just so good. You should just read it if you haven't already. Just you should just definitely read this. So that's the end of this video and if you liked it, please like and subscribe. If you've read any of these novels, please let me know what you think about it because obviously I love them and I would like to know if you liked them or if you didn't like them. Um, if there's any other books that you think would be good to start off with, what book do you start off with, things like that, just like let me know what you think, let me know what you think about the video and everything like that. So thank you so much and I hope you enjoyed watching.